their organization claims Catholic values are being threatened over a pride prom at Marquette. An online petition already has thousands of signatures trying to stop this month's LGBT event. Julia Fellow is live from campus with reaction from all sides. Julia? Elise and Vince, good morning to you. We have confirmed that at least one former Marquette professor has signed this online petition along with former students. Despite all of this, university leaders say this will go on as planned April 14th. Those online signatures are being collected right now to, quote, stop LGBT pride prom, claiming the April 14th event destroys moral values. Marquette grad Cameron Sanchez says at first he did not take this seriously. But then I went online and I saw that they had 18,000 signatures. The petition is on a website called the American Society for the Defense of Tradition, Family and Property. The director of the organization refused to talk to us on camera but sent me a statement writing in part that promoting this pride prom is like promoting drugs for those who suffer from a drug addiction. They're hurtful, but they're not Marquette. I mean, Marquette's motto is be the difference. In none of my theology classes did they teach um, you know, anything that wasn't accepting and love. And so I think it was disappointing to see. Sanchez and former classmate Paige Gardner recently set up a fundraiser called Blackout Hate at bars near Cathedral Square. We treated this organization as an inspiration and not as our opposition. More than $2,200 was raised for the Cream City Foundation, which provides resources for Milwaukee's LGBT community. It was kind of exciting to see, you know, people hear other people's stories and interact with people that they may not have. The leader hosting this petition page claims many Marquette students and alumni have signed the petition, and so far the university has not answered our concerns. Marquette University leaders sent me a statement that reads in part, we support our LGBT community and we also take seriously the catechism of the Catholic Church's note that people should not rush and rash judgment of their neighbor. They also add that Pride Palm once again will go on as scheduled at Union Hall and all students are welcome. Reporting on the Marquette University campus, Julia Fellow, today's TMJ4.